Okay, let's move on then. It's gonna be FTNK coming out as a uh, wax artist again. I guess Opera was banned. It's gonna be Trump card. Uh, no, Insulin's detention with Max Pilot breaking here. We're trying to lock the windows upstairs. But if you lock the windows upstairs, all what 9J has to do is. Oh, wait, we're jumping down. We predicted that Toy Merchant might be somewhere outside, but we don't see full prints. We don't really see. Ah, oh, we do see where she is now. Okay, at least we see where she is now. She deploys that down. You can just jump in then if that's the case. Yeah, this is gonna be a long day for Wax Artist. He does have teleport though so with this in mind if you're gonna go after toy merchant first you're just trying to consume one of her catapults so she doesn't have another one left to use 11 rotating away here immediately as well very nicely done we're trying not to give as much space as possible here for wax artists but even with that in mind since this is quite a nice tight area you know it's a gk without an accessory so he should be able to contain for a relatively long time jelly here first chase that's 70 a 100 wax nicely done fast battle breaking and normal hit registered good job very nicely done uh, with Jelly on mind, if he wants to continue for a little bit longer, he needs to get that gun out properly. Which means that he, he like, like he needs he needs to get the gun out and he needs to be able to cut into tight corners and not get long waxed. If he gets waxed from a distance, then it's going to be a meter down. But since a teleport was used, as we can see here, one of the biggest reasons why not a lot of hunters like to use teleport is because if they just decode early game, that's all really what it matters. Because with a 90 second, well, Jelly contained 30 seconds. We'll be fully honest, he contained 30, 40 seconds. But why is the Cypher machine so fast? It's because you wasted 50, sec 50 seconds early game. And you're a wax artist, right? Going against wax artist, Gala, Bomb Bomb, do whatever the heck you want. Just decode. Whoever gets chased first, just decode. It doesn't really matter. But but if it's Dreamwitch, Opera, etc., etc., which you can uh, change targets really easily, then it's not so easy. Then you need to rotate early game. And, you know, those type of characters doesn't really bring teleport as well because Blink is much more important than teleport in that case scenario. So, oh well, what can we do? Uh, seems like Eleven's going to be able to come in with a rescue. That's going to be a very fast 0 0.5 second rescue and a gun immediately in straight towards the face. No box on our Cordy here. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. No ox on Cordy, and guess what? Toy Merchant Catapult. Oh, it's not being placed down just yet. Okay, Toy Merchant should be putting down Catapult soon, but it seems like we're going to give a needle to Coordinator here instead. Toy Merchant, on the other hand, running upstairs. That Cypher Machine near Toy Toy was finished, which is good news. But of course, guess what we have? We have a Catapult delivery right there. Three, two, one, up, up, and away. Break some ankles while you're at it. There's no fall damage in this game. If there was fall damage in this game, there's no way Toy Merchant would ever put anything on. You know what? Implement fall damage, please. It'd be so funny to see. <laughs> Anyways, back towards the game. Jelly rushing straight towards Small Bow. Small Bow being... Small Bow is a really strong area, especially for uh, survivors to go to play against Wax Artists. And you have Windows, you have Pallets, you have Fireballs, and you have uh, an Acrobat who basically... Acrobat, you know what? Changing targets here might not be a bad idea, honestly. Might not be a bad idea, honestly. Okay, Acrobat, that's going to be brilliant. Flywheel used, and you don't have any wax to use because of the fireball. We're currently waiting, we're currently waiting. We're still, we're still jumping and waiting and playing around as long as possible here. But it seems like 4A7 is going down here. Okay, 4A7 going down is good news, right? The good... Good reason why it's good is because it's currently a new chair, which means even if you get the rescue next time, that means there's going to be no one on chair. Basically, there's no one dead on chair, so it's not a tie game. It's still a four man end game. It won't even if you teleport. It's not. It's not like you get someone down immediately and then you can just teleport out. You have to wait. So in this case scenario, toy merchant is currently downstairs and toy merchant is going to be able to get some walks here but i guess since this is big but after all it's going to be pretty hard for you to get any walks on you did manage to lock the window which is good for you but it's toy merchant we're talking about at the end of the day here so um, that's gonna be Okay, that's going to be Toy Merchant going down. That's going to be Toy Merchant going down, but they have a Cypher Machine at 50%. Courtney are looking for an item. And I guess GK can... Maybe not GK, but Acrobat coming into rescue is fine here as well. 63% Cypher Machine. Uh, we're decoding the Cypher at the very edge right now. We do have Tinnitus here because Acrobat is already in. Acrobat used the ball just to get in as early as possible. Just so Wax Artist can't fire ball him down. Fire, fire, fire. Hot Wax him down. So that's another thing we need to keep in consideration of. So your items need to be used not for containment but also for rescue purposes. Then aside from machines, Tony Primed. Good news. Bad news is we need to hide behind the chair. Oh, Terror Shock! Nice! Nice Terror Shock! Oh, okay, okay, it's a tie game. Okay, it's okay. 4A7 got Terror Shocked really hard right there. We got Terror Shocked really hard right there. God damn, that Terror Shock was beautiful. 
God damn, that terror shock was beautiful. Hopefully, it will never happen again after this. But gosh damn, that, that terror shock was possible. So there goes our four man endgame. Ended up as a tie or a three man elimination. We just have to see how this goes. Okay, then eleven on the way out. We, it is a GK wish, you know. It is a GK with shovel, so it's fine. Even if you get a teleport right here, GK just gets into her shovel. GK shovel, GK shovel. Okay, GK shovel. Okay, as long as he shovels, it's fine here. As long as he shovels, it's still a tie game. As long as the shovel is still a tie game here, so let's congratulate the tie here from Wolves. I mean, tie here from STNK, honestly. But moving on. Okay, let's move on now. We're going to be able to see Tawai coming out as a Night Watch. There's going to be a journalist on the team here as well, followed by Psycho, GK, and Priestess. So it's two slow decoders followed by uh, two healers, which I guess makes sense to a certain extent. It's going to be top down, confined space detention. It's more of a fork build here. We do have Hunter's Instincts. We have we do have a uh, Rage and Claustrophobia. Well, not Claustrophobia, Berserker. But, you know, with this in mind, I guess going against uh, a journalist right after her buff, she does have four puppets now to use. She does have a containment build here as well. So I guess what matters for Tawai is to break the pallets really, really, really fast. That's what is on his mind right now. It seems like CC is going to be stomped here immediately. And that's going to be a first hit. Ah, he didn't register. Good job, CC. Good job, my friend. Oh, my lord. That's very nicely done. That is very, very very nicely done our next little orphy now is ready we could deploy a little orphy down here good job newspaper boy newspaper boy gets the vault over and slow debuff gets the vault over and slow debuff so with this in mind that's gonna be a normal hit there register we bought 20 extra seconds just with that mini twirl there Oh yeah, yeah, just with that mini troll there, but of course teleport might be a small bit of an issue. Oh, uh, we need to get rid of Lamp Portal first, maybe. Lamp Portal goes first, and then we will go in and see Journalist. Journalist, speed boost, slow debuff. Yeah, speed boost, slow debuff, and even if you have a little Orphe right behind you, you most likely wouldn't be able to get a Terror Shock there, sadly. Not Terror Shock, we wouldn't be able to get a Body Block there, sadly, and you didn't really put down the pilot down properly, so yeah, well, there's that too. No, 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 no long distance. For the left, no long portals left. We do have a still have a priestess in big bow here, so you do have the chair camp here properly. For Tawai, I guess you can just use Typhoon and get gain a little bit more stacks. Now then, um, with this on uh, mind, priestess is going to oh that's a very nice portal. You know what? MS survivors always finds a way with the portals. MS survivors really always find a way with the portals. We are waiting, we're waiting, we're waiting. We got the pullback, we're waiting, we're still waiting, we're still looking, we're still waiting. We want to get the body block, but we didn't get it on time. Okay, we can get rid of the portal here then. We can get rid of the portal here then. Yeah, that's the thing. Wait, wait, cat survivors, cat survivors. The priestess always knows some really good portal spaces, Lamal. That's another one in the box right now, I guess. But uh, second chair on journalist. It should be a tie game here coming from the survivor side. It would be very surprised if it isn't a tie game. You have two tie turners. Well, you've won tie turner and you haven't used one. So you save a priestess in two storage just to give to Nidus and to contain for a really long time since it's a big bolt. And um, I don't think you can teleport just yet. You have to wait at least 90% to teleport. You do have to wait for at least 90% here to teleport. GK and GK is at the corner. Meanwhile, you do have Psycho. Psycho tanks three hits, so it should be fine. But if Psycho gets chased here, no tight turner psychologist might be the biggest issue of it all. We're looking for OVO right now. OVO going downstairs. OVO going downstairs. OVO rotating towards the back. OVO still looking for more. Since we are looking for more, it seems like right now, Priestess might be uh, one of the worst places possible. Jumping down here at the same time, Priestess. That's going to be a dash here up here immediately. OVO gets an normal hit there. We do have two portals now on hand. Two portals in mind. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, I mean, it's a confined space fast pattern breaking night watch. So, uh, we're getting as much slow debuffs here as possible. Force the portal out. Do we do we speed boost? We speed boost and gets a normal hit down. Okay. Nicely done. Nicely done by Tawai. But of course, OVO did a really good. Priestess also did a really good job there with the long containment. Because now, the Cypher Machine should be more than enough. Sui is going to come in for the rescue. Is uh, I guess that's fine. I guess that's fine. You want to save the Tide Turner for later. You do want to save the Tide Turner for later. And I guess it's also because of the fact that the Cypher Machine is a big ball. Oh no, we're, we're in a really bad place right now. Um, we need to get a hit on towards GK, Typhoon back, hit on towards GK, you either dash over or Typhoon back, you probably could Typhoon back, no we're gonna slow debuff here instead, okay, slow debuff on mine, that's, mm, it is what it is, it's okay for now, we're decoding the 50% Cypher Machine done by Priestess early game, that's gonna be the rescue, that's gonna be no pilots done there, which is a little bit unfortunate, but that's also still fine, because there's a psychologist on, uh, on the Cypher Machine right now, but we're gonna change targets here instead, uh, GK needs to get in towards Shovel, 
GK needs to get into a shovel. Yeah, GK just has to continue here. Preferably speaking, if GK can go towards can go towards um priestess and heal priestess, everything should be fine. Two reasons. Reason number one being the fact that Psycho of full health three hits can't be consumed. Reason number two being the fact that priestess heals really fast since it's a priestess at the end of the day. Seems like we're changing targets here immediately. If, if we're changing targets here, Psycho needs to whistle GK immediately. Psycho needs to whistle GK if we're changing targets here immediately. Where's our whistle? Where's our boom? Where's the, where's the whistle? Where's the distress call? We're going in to rescue, but preferably speaking here, we should have... Ah, uh, we should not have used self-heal. We really should not have used self-heal right there. Uh, there was no need to use self-heal. That's a portal over. That's a really nice portal over. Uh, GK trying to body block here for as much as possible, but seems like the... Shovel is gonna dissipate soon. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got the down. We got the down. Psycho needs to be the one that whistles GK. We should have whistled earlier. We're too late for the whistle. We should have whistled there earlier. It's okay for you to actually chair. It's honestly okay for you, for for Twilight to chair priestess, but not for priestess to use up self heal. It seems like right now it's gonna be psychologist who's gonna be the one coming in for rescue. Meanwhile, GK is gonna be decoding that sixty five percent information. It's still fine for now. That's a very nice placement there by the ah no not like this not like this. You did not. Ah, uh, no, please. God, you're gonna get body. Oh. oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Nightwatch is. Nightwatch is thick. Man, you thick AF. You thick ass boy. Jesus Christ, that's gonna be a terror shock, damn. Oh, we need you. Thick ass boy. Genuine, genuinely thick ass boy. Jesus Christ, you thick ass boy. Um, I did not expect that. I thought I thought he wasn't wide enough. I thought his character wasn't wide enough to do that. But um, I guess with this on mind, that's gonna be the pallet here broken for the second time, and with the pallet broken for the third time too. There's a dungeon on the other side. We're gonna speed things up, and it might be, might be a. Okay, if we wait for Flywheel here, it should be fine. Ah, well, I mean, uh, crows. Okay, fair enough. Let's congratulate the four-man animation here for some white. Again, moving on. Bye-bye.